one mom's journey, life-changing journey, has turned into a mission to educate others. That's next. How her travels to Africa inspired a book she's hoping to share with her students. Well, a stay-at-home mom wanted to know more about her heritage, so she traveled to Ghana. And when she came home, she wrote a children's book about what she discovered because she was so moved. Her adventure is what's right with Tampa Bay. You won't believe this, Mama shouted with joy. Stephanie Clater is sharing a very special book with her children, Kyler and Olivia. Where, asked Kyler? It's a book about her travels to Ghana. She wrote it to teach kids about African culture. It's important for our kids to know that, hey, you come from a civilization that is known for gold, is known for cocoa, which is turned into chocolate and, and distributed all over the world. Stephanie's illustrations are drawn from pictures of her own experiences. Some of the pictures you'll see in there are exact replicas of what I saw when I was over there. The process that they use to make kente cloth, it's like an ancient process. They hand weave it, the men, and so you'll see that demonstrated in the book. And Stephanie says she's learned a lot from the pilgrimage. It's not just lions and tigers. Um, it's not just the pyramids in Egypt. There is, there's so many cultures, so many countries over there to learn about, different languages. Hoping now the book enlightens kids about African culture and their traditions. I got to visit the Ashanti kingdom. I heard the word Ashanti throughout my life. Didn't know that it was a kingdom that was, had been around for centuries and that it was known for gold and they had such rich traditions, things such as the golden stool. A trip that became the adventure of a lifetime, now shared with others. I loved it when I went over there. I had a really good time and it just really touched my heart and I felt that we need to change the narrative and teach our youth more about Africa. Pretty neat, huh? The illustrations are amazing. She's hoping to get her book into the school system. And if you'd like to know where to find Stephanie's book, go to fox13news.com quick. We live here and then look for what's right. We just had the Scholastic Book Fair at my kid's school the other day. They wanted to go in every single day. Well, that's great. And they've got so that's many great. great ones, so maybe she can add hers. There's some great stories in there for yeah. sure. Great messages. <laughs>